What's up guys, I'm Luke from AndroidCreate.com and today I'm going to show you how to install Google Now on your ice cream sandwich device. I will also be showing you how to activate the voice search functionality in it too. So thanks to the guys over at XA Developers for making this possible, they're awesome. I'll link you to the original forum post uh, where I got these downloads. So to do this, your device must be rooted and you must be running Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich. You'll also need a Root 5 Explorer. For this specific video, I'll be using Root Explorer. I'll also provide a link to that in the description. So let's get started. Uh, first of all, you want to download two of the files in the description, uh, connect your device via USB to the, your PC, and drag them over to your device's storage. And the next thing you want to do is go to Root Explorer, and go to System, and then go into App, scroll down until you find Google Quick Search Box, right here, and you want to hold this down and rename it to, oh, excuse me, you have to hit the mount uh, or slash W button, you have to, now we can rename it, rename it to Google Quick Search Box dot B, B A K. So instead of APK, it's B A K. So there it is, Google Quick Search Box dot B A K. Click done. Now go back, uh, go back here, back again, go to SD card. If you put this on your actual uh, micro SD card, you will have to go into sdcard.ext. I put this on my internal storage, so I'm going into SD card. Scroll down again until you find Velvet. Uh, just find Velvet. That's one of the files that you downloaded. Rename this. You want to rename this to Google Quick Search Box .apk. And now after you've renamed this to uh, Google Quick Search Box .apk, you click OK. And now what you want to do is go back up and you want to copy it. Go back. Go to System and App like you did before and Paste. So when you've done that, you want to you want to change the permissions so that it can actually do stuff. So hold down, scroll down, and change your permissions. Okay, and you want to change it to what I have set. So it's like a right angle like that. You click OK, and now what you want to do is reboot your device. So after your device is rebooted, Google Now is actually installed right now, but uh, there is no uh, voice search functionality. So to do this, you want to go back into Root Explorer, you want to go to SD card, and now you want to go to Google Now Voice Search .apk. This is one of the files that you actually downloaded and put onto your device storage. Now you want to you want to sort of press on that install. Just click install again. And once that has been installed, you want to click Open. So this is where you'll actually be using Google Now's voice search from. Uh, so let's ask it a question. What's the weather? As you can see, it brings up a card there, the temperature. It's pretty awesome, guys. It works really, really well. So if you actually want to use Google Now's standard functionality, you just go here into the menu, scroll over to Google. It actually brings up Google Now, just without the voice search functionality. If you actually want to use the voice search, you have to go. You have to go through the app that we just installed, and it works really well, guys. So if it if this helped you out, guys, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know if you, if it works for you. If you have any questions, feel free to comment and ask. Check out AndroidCrate.com for the latest Android news and reviews. I'll see you next time, guys.